Hi, today I will show you how to make the manual DLP to connect your Wi-Fi automatically. Um, uh, some clients will ignore that why the manual DLP didn't can connect your Wi-Fi automatically because uh, the nano DLP just have uh, you don't why set the um, param param parameter to the to the Durbin system. Uh, the nano DLP is based on the very simple Durbin system. So some if you can set it why you can uh, that can be automatic connected so today if your LDLP is even type the password uh, to your nano DLP with the Wi-Fi file so after a week or some days when you restart your nano DLP you find it's a IP address is missing. Just so the one two seven point zero point zero one the whole IP address it didn't connect to your Wi-Fi. So when you encounter this situation, you need to throw it with this way. That can be uh, forever um, not the Tem, 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 tempor, temperate, great. So now I will show you how to do this. Uh, because you missed the Wi-Fi, so you need to connect it to with the network cable. See this below. Connect to your PC. Then it will capture its PC um, IP address one three seven point one zero one. So. Go to your putties. Uh, the first thing, there's a two thing we need to uh, we need to do it. This is one thing is uh, set right the network interface. So uh, at the command line, so to do this network interface to add up the to edit the interface. Uh, you can add the below line here to your interface file then save it and you need to edit another file the file is the WAP subscription call this is why you need to add up your Wi-Fi information below you see here, uh, all the lives are the same, but you need just to revise the Wi-Fi name and your Wi-Fi password. And if the Wi-Fi name is your uh, Wi-Fi name, as you see, my Wi-Fi is PTCD who five five six six seven nine eight. So just just change this into your Wi-Fi name and your Wi-Fi password below here, and add this line to the web supplication call, and save this file, and then we we boot the your Nano DLP. Everything is okay. Now we can show you. How to make it? You have to put it lock to one point one one oh one oh one password pi and then uh, uh, names pi password let's be Mary log onto it. Put it lock onto it, then add 
add this line, add this command line to edit the interface. Now you can see here I add up I add up this line to this interface. Uh, you can you can copy it. And cut it here. Then control add O save it. Control X. Oh, no, no, no. Control add X to exit. You can re uh, redo this to see whether it has this command I. Yes, it has this command I. We exit it and the next we need is to add the command line of the added the uh, supplicate call here. Okay. Now you see, I have, I have, I have already added up the this line. The below line to my uh, was uh, was February, so you can also add this line to your Nano DLP. So I did. I don't show. I don't show. I don't want to show many of this, but but it's the same line to your. That's and if if this. Uh, with this line, you can uh, do uh, after doing these two steps, you you can be both. We both. We both your nano nano DLPs. And now you can. Take off your network network cable, and after if this is it will start, it will recapture the Wi-Fi, and will show is one point one two three. But now it's not restart. After it's it's absolutely we start we will, we will receive the new IP address it's not we start now we need to wait Okay, it's not moving now. You will see if you automatically connect it to your Wi Fi.
Okay. You see? It's a um, new IP address. One, two, three, four, two, eight. So, uh, with this setting, whatever you restart your nano DIP, you can it can automatically connect to your Wi-Fi as well.